KFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Wednesday, two hours left to go in the trading day. We have all the indices in positive territory right now. S&P is positive by seven points, trading at 2865. You get the NASDAQ 100 up 112, 9036. We have the Dow basically flat right now. 23,764 was actually flat to the point. As I said that, Russell 2000, Russell up about five points at 1272. We've got some action in gold, negative $23 at 1687. Oil, negative $1.12 at 2344. Silver, negative six pennies at 1504. Start things off, <clears throat> excuse me, jump over to the VIX. As we've marched to higher territory in the market the last couple of days, the VIX pulling back from 40.32 early, early Monday, now sitting 32 and change for the second consecutive day. Jumping back to the charts, we'll start things off with the NASDAQ 100. We got a little bit of volatility, market lows right at about 10 a.m. of 89.38. We're now trading up a solid 100 points from that price level at 9,032. S&P 500 trading at 28.63, much nearer to the bottom range of the market trading today, that range being 28.50. Yesterday, you see the sell-off begin at about 3.30, excuse me, at about 3 p.m. Eastern time. We were up as high as 28.90, so we're about 1% off that level. You see the range from about 28.60 up to anywhere from about 28.80 to 28.90 in the S&Ps. Dow 30, right near the lower end of all the trading, 23,746. We've made lows on a couple occasions, 10 a.m., 23,654, and also at 11.45, 23,663. There's your crude oil market trading lower early in the day from 7 a.m. at 50, excuse me, 25.50, down to 22.61. You're talking about almost $3 crude traded in less than two hours, $3 in less than two hours, and we're up a bit from that level at 23.41. There's your gold contract trading lower for most of the session from about 17.11 as of 8 a.m., currently trading at 16.87, and the euro US dollar at 108.06. Jumping around to some of the stocks with action today GM out with their earnings, they're up 4.5%. Yet Disney with their earnings after the bell, talk about some volatility, but guess what? Within about three pennies of where we closed at yesterday on Disney. Disney, Activision up 6%, and on the flip side of that, EA down 3.7%. Stay tuned, folks. Dave White coming up live with the Power Trading Hour from 2 till 3 Eastern Time. Tom O'Brien live from 3 till 4. We'll be right back with live programming, folks.